everybody if you're uh anything like me you have been playing vr or have just bought a vr headset or have plugged in a, a gaming device to your computer running an nvidia card and have been running into an issue lately where where your computer doesn't go to sleep anymore right, let me just demonstrate see right here i have a screensaver enabled it'll, it'll be a blank screen it's set to go off after one minute all right so let me just run a test real quick i'm going to speed up the footage for you Okay, you'll see that it's been a minute, uh, a little bit over a minute, and the screensaver has not turned on yet. Now, the issue that's happening, at least from my point of view, is that NVIDIA thinks that there's a video game being played right now, even though there isn't. And so it's not allowing the computer to go to sleep or turn on a screensaver. So the way that I fixed it was I just go to the GeForce Experience app, which is located right there on your lower right. NVIDIA settings, you right click on it, click on GeForce Experience, or you just type it up in here. Okay, you gotta, if you haven't used this before, you gotta sign in with your Facebook or, or create an account. It's kind of lame, but it's what you have to do. And you'll see that the in game overlay is turned on. All I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna turn it off. Okay, so let me just uh, hit that. Okay, it's turned off now. And I will reset the clock, and you'll see that after a minute, and some change since I moved the mouse, uh, after hitting start, it'll go to a screensaver. And there you go. It went to a screensaver because the NVIDIA in-game overlay is not enabled. So NVIDIA software thinks that a video game is being played and it forces your monitor to stay on to run that in-game overlay. So the way you fix that is you just go to your GeForce Experience and disable the in-game overlay. Hopefully they'll patch it up in the next update or so. Yeah, because I, I do like using the, their their update for frame counting or for live streaming on a lower end or, you know, just having that thing up in the background recording uh, video if I'm not using OBS. So, yeah, there you go. That's how you fix it. That's how you get your monitor to go back to sleep. All right. Hope this helps. Thanks for watching.